Hey everybody, I'm Christopher Green. You're watching AMTV Alternative Media Television. It is, of course, January 15th, 2019. Please share this video, click that thumbs up right now, and also click that bell. A lot of people have been telling me that they're not getting updates to their subscription feed, so make sure you do that and get it out to the viewing public. So we have a major development over the last 48 hours, and there is so much going on, it is honestly disorienting. We have total chaos in the UK with the Brexit revote. We have yellow vest protesters calling for bank runs, gas leak explosions in Paris. We have impeachment proceedings about to enrage and engulf the president of the United States here in the USA. We have the largest shutdown that the United States has ever had. We have Wall Street on fumes. Jamie Dimon, head of one of the world's largest banks, says because of the shutdown, economic growth could be zero here this quarter. And it should be clear as we see this disruption in Europe right now occurring as people fear a run on food, a run on water, basic emergency kits, and survival supplies, that the only thing missing in this conflagration of events is the big one. I tweeted this yesterday. Please follow me on Twitter, at AMTV Media. The only thing that is missing is a big event worldwide, and it is clear something is coming to the United States. Now, Donald Trump tweeted this very ominously. This was from Patrick Buchanan's op-ed article a few days ago, which said this, border is eventually going to be militarized and defended or the United States, as we have known it, is going to cease to exist. And Americans will not go gentle into that good night. The great people of our country demand proper border security now. So he's hinting to a giant crisis. He's hinting to militarization of our borders, to an event coming from a very famous poem that says explicitly, and Americans will not go gentle into that good night. So what is the president not telling us, or, or what is he telling us? What is he not saying, and what is coming to the USA? Again, Congress could simply do the right thing, approve some $5 billion, and all of this would be over in 15 minutes. But they refuse to do it. We have 800,000 plus government employees furloughed, not getting paid, taking out emergency loans, buying food and water stockpiles. So this is turning into a very, very serious event. Airport security screeners could quit in mass, grounding flights. The federal courts could stop hearing civil cases. We saw somebody smuggle in a firearm past TSA just yesterday. In one case, city buses could stop running. And 38 million Americans who depend on food stamps could stop getting food stamps altogether. Officials from Washington to Wall Street are pondering nightmare scenarios if the partial U.S. government shutdown that is already the longest on record extends into the spring or possibly beyond. Shutdowns don't get bad linearly. They get bad exponentially, said Sam Berger, a senior advisor at the Center for American Progress. President Donald Trump's administration has found creative means to blunt some of the shutdown's effects figuring out ways to process tax refunds, for example. Yet agencies that have been able to dip into user fees, leftover funds, and other revenue streams are running out of those reserves. So we're already starting to see lawsuits coming, testing the administration's ability to keep on the job unpaid workers, hundreds of thousands of whom missed their first paycheck last week. We have teachers and the Los Angeles Teachers Union for the first time in decades protesting, walking out right now. So the point should be that this is heating up. The point should be is a major event is coming to the United States and worldwide. We saw a very aggressive overture also from China today saying that they would fight to protect what they believe is rightfully theirs, the island of Taiwan, at any cost, threatening the United States Navy. It should be clear, something big is coming. It is so important to get right with God, get right with the guy upstairs, and also to prepare. Please take a moment. I'm going to keep it short today. Just I want to hear your thoughts, your commentary in the box below. What do you think Donald Trump was saying in that tweet that he put out just a couple of days ago? Americans will not go quietly into the night. 
What do you think he's going to do in terms of militarizing the border? How long do you think that this government shutdown could last? When will this spill out of control in the UK and the Eurozone as they attempt to revote for a second time on a no deal? It is clear that this is going nowhere. It is clear that things are getting worse. So get this video out. Make sure you're taking preparations. In fact, we just launched at the AMTV store, store.amtvmedia.com. Click the link below the AMTV shutdown box. Get everything that you need. Get 84 servings, the essentials of food, entrees, plus breakfast items, plus an emergency survival kit, plus a water filter, all for a great price limited time right now. It's the shutdown box. It's shutdownbox.com. Click the link below right now. Guys, you're going to want to have food preps. We are already seeing supply disruptions in Europe as a result of the Brexit and the UK leaving the European Union. This is coming to the United States next. Most of you know that, for example, if the trucking industry shuts down for more than two days, grocery stores are completely empty. So you're going to want to have food. You're going to want to have water. And if you're one of the millions of Americans out there that doesn't have food storage, you're going to want to get this box. Again, it's shutdownbox.com or click the link below. Get this box right away. We're going to sell out. I'm only offering this a limited time. So make sure you're taking the preparations on food and water. Get right with God. And then also, I want to hear your comments and questions in the box below. What do you think is coming, in to, coming next to the United States? And what do you think Donald Trump is inferring about militarizing our border and Americans not going quietly into the night? I'm Christopher Green. Get out everywhere. Make it viral, hard-hitting, and in your face. Click the link below to get your AMTV shutdown box. Limited time while supplies last. God bless.